My district has been full-time brick and mortar face-to-face. -face. Rachel Curry has been teaching students in her socially distant classroom since August. The math and geometry teacher is happy to see kids face-to-face -face at Red Lion Area High School, but there are challenges. We're showing up to school every day, masking and trying to maintain distancing, but it's really difficult um, to be a good teacher and maintain all of that. Curry hopes the Johnson & Johnson vaccine will give educators one less thing to worry about. But I think, you know, everybody is going to feel better once we have more vaccinations. Some schools like Benjamin Franklin Elementary here in Harrisburg have remained virtual only. Those school district officials hope that the vaccine will ease the transition back to in-person learning. Harrisburg School District's acting superintendent said the timing is excellent for the governor's teacher vaccination plan. He was happy that elementary school teachers would be prioritized first. The school district could potentially start bringing its kids back into classrooms as early as next month. In Harrisburg, Tom Lehman, WGAL News 8.